Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's been quite a while since I sat in this chair, so um, excuse me if I'm a little bit rusty as well. We're here now today. Um, is my hair looking good? Okay. So what I'm going to be doing today is a long overdue, long requested. It has been requested a couple of times. I'm not gonna say many times, but it has been a video that I've been thinking about doing for a while now. Um, it has been requested a couple of times for me to do an updated what's in my bag video. And this is one of my favorite videos to watch on YouTube because I am I'm like, I'm sneaky. I like to snoop. I like to, you know, like I wanna know what people People carry around in their bags and I'm actually on my way out and I thought that this would be the perfect time because my bag is full of all the things that I need if I look a little bit different I haven't slept at all this was the first night ever in my life that I was up I didn't go anywhere I wasn't chilling somewhere and having a good time with people and whatever I was in my bed and I made a big mistake of taking medication that I shouldn't have taken later than 3 p.m. I took it at 8.30 p.m. and it disturbs the sleep. So I couldn't sleep, I haven't slept. So if I seem a little bit different or if I seem a little bit delirious in this video or if I over chat, then it is possibly because I haven't slept and I'm hoping that you guys won't judge me for it. But anyway, so uh, just in case if I'm not in focus, this is the bag that I am carrying. If I don't look like I'm in focus, it's because I have to move back and then all of that, but I'll soon adjust that. But this is the bag that I'm carrying. It's a bag from Aldo. I really love this bag. I love the fact that it's structured. I love the fact that it's, it's suede on the one side and then it's leather on this side. It's so, so cute. I wanted a bag with structure and um, many of my bags are like totes or they kind of, you know, it's only the small bags that have a bit of structure to them. But most of my big bags are sort of like chilled laid back, like totey, slouchy. Um, there's not many bags that I have that are structured bags except uh i've got a celine one and yeah that's pretty much the only structured bag and i i never use that bag i i think i use that bag when i don't know i just i just don't like showcasing that bag but anyway absolutely love this bag to bits um it's proper it's such a ladylike bag you know it's so decent it's so pretty you know so yeah as you open the bag that is pretty much everything that's inside the bag that we're gonna yank out I really love I love the structure of this bag it maintains its structure quite well um, I'm looking in the viewfinder because I need to make sure that you all are seeing what I'm seeing but um, yeah it, it maintains its structure quite well and it's got a whole lot of junk in there junk in the trunk but I'm gonna show you everything that's in there so not much to explain there that's my phone I literally put it in the bag just before I recorded this video because I want my phone nearby me because I'm gonna leave soon so I needed my phone nearby me the next thing out are eyelashes I keep spare eyelashes <laughs> in my bag just in case you never know where you might end up or you where you might end up going or you might be carrying lashes and then something happens the wind blows off one lash and whatever you just need a spare of eyelashes and these are the Ardell Demi Wispy lashes which are really really nice um, and then the next thing out is my hand cream this is a hand cream that I spoke about in I think a beauty review which probably should be up by now if it's not I'm sorry okay I'm, I'm running behind on editing but this is um, cranberry and acerola cherry uh, hand and nail cream from Woolies I've spoken about this nail cream on this channel probably twice now so you must pretty much know about it okay I've got two of these little small pouches now the thing is with me I hate my bag getting untidy if it's untidy the only untidy thing about it is I'm a sleepy, I'm, on, I'm a sweetie. You know when you get sweets at like a restaurant and they give you sweets and you just throw them in your bag because I know I've got a little sister and at some point I'm going to need to bribe the girl, okay? I'm going to need to bribe her. So I need sweets in my bag at all times, all times. Um, but I keep pouches in my bag to uh, prevent my bag getting messy and 
just things falling all over the place makeup all over the place i hate my bags getting stained from makeup like it's actually a pet peeve i hate that stuff so this one you guys know about i think i've showed you guys this even in my previous uh what's in my bag thing it's got um <laughs> it's got lady feminine products okay it's got um, um feminine wipes okay it's got <laughs> lovers plants okay protect yourself always be ready always be prepared <laughs> wow tmi your girl's feeling kind of flustered you know what i'm saying but protect yourself girl like you don't know where you might end up one night you might end up in somebody's house and stuff and blah 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 protect yourself at all times so i carry that kind of stuff in this little pouch and then in this one i carry just little things i might want to you know coins um slips i've made it a point that i carry slips in this particular pouch because i don't like slips all over my bags i i find it very very annoying i find it very very untidy but one of the things that i put in this bag is um a long jeans watch the reason why is because if I find myself at the mall where I got this watch, I need to change the battery. The battery is flat, so it's not moving, and it's one of my favorite, favorite watches. I received it for my birthday some years back, and I absolutely love it. I got this cup. Isn't this cup, like, the prettiest thing? I got this cup when I was in starbucks the other day and it was on some sort of special so yeah the next thing out is ruterina femme now i don't know if you know much about ruterina femme ruterina femme is a probiotic and if you're a female you should look into taking probiotics if you're not uh, i am somebody who is very prone well i was prone it's it's been over two years now i've been so lucky <laughs> Uh, I've been very, I was very, very prone to UTIs, like I would get them more than the normal female would get UTIs. I would get them all the damn time and it would annoy me so much and I ended up having to go see a urologist. Not only annoy me, but it... Um, it killed my self-confidence. I didn't want to get intimate with people and whatever. It was just, it's a long thing. But if you want a video on that, let me know and we can do it. But it's great for just balancing things out, protecting you from infections and things like that. Very, very good for women to be on probiotics. So I take these every single day. I need to take one now, actually. So mm, that's a reminder. And uh, next out is a sun case. Sun case? sunglass case and it's from zara i am really digging the zara sunglasses lately man i am digging them and i picked these up uh also a couple of weeks ago very nice cat eye yes do me lang guy return very very nice cat eye um sunglass and the reason why i like this one i've tried many cat eye sunglasses i just felt either they were too big or i just felt either they were too small and this one is pretty much perfect for my face and i love how it frames my face and yeah these are the ones that i carry around with me uh the next thing out is yet another pouch and this is my makeup pouch this is what i carry makeup in so anything that i need to touch up on during the day i've got highlighter in here i've got the tweezers for the lashes glue for the lashes i've got uh yeah fenty beauty highlighter i've got a ton of lip products obviously and that's ironic because i'll show you what's next that's coming uh i've got a powder in here which wow wow okay I've got a powder brushes whatever just those little things here and there that you might need for your bag i've got in there just to touch up your makeup during the day and the reason why i said i've got lots of lip products in there this is entirely a lip product case this has got all lip products it's got uh let's see do we have time mm, do we have time yes um cat von d uh, Anastasia Beverly Hills, oh my god, a Dior lip glow, oh my god, a perfume, an Atelier perfume, just in case I don't make it home tonight, I just like to have 
lip options and I don't want to be judged for it. Okay, judge me. Fine. Judge me. And then the next thing out obviously is my purse. I've been using this purse for quite a while now. Probably maybe even in the last the last um what's in my bag video you might have seen this purse. This is a Charles and Keith purse that I've been using for quite a minute now i love it it's very sturdy it carries everything i don't have to worry about it i've got a nail filer in here because sometimes i chip something and i want to just quickly touch it up um it's a standard i always have a nail filer in my bag well as of late over the last couple of months i always have a nail filer in my bag just to touch up my nails should i need to um carmax Carmex is a standard in my life because I love the stuff. If I don't want to put on, if I feel like my lips are feeling a little tingly, like there might be a little bit of herpes or something coming on, nila. The bag is almost empty. So the next thing out is another lip gloss that I've really been loving. This is from Catrice Cosmetics. I hardly buy anything from Catrice Cosmetics. I really, really love this volumizing lip booster. In fact, that's what I have on my lips right now. So can just touch it up you know what i'm saying and then the next thing out is a small modern muse i actually don't have any ooh, i don't i didn't put any perfume on today so here we go this is a modern muse from estee lauder um i really really like this perfume as well it smells absolutely amazing especially for the summertime i really really like it i feel like i'm not sounding loud enough but my ears, my nose, my nasal, everything is just messed up. And is Zambak. Zambak, there's always a reason why I have a Zambak in my bag. If it's not for the herpes, it's for tattoos. This one probably landed up in my bag because Zambak is also great on tattoos. Uh, even though this time around when I did these um, tattoos here, um, I used Pseudocreme quite a lot. But Zambak actually works quite well on tattoos as well, just in case. And the last two things out of the bag are a Woolies food snack bar. And this is the almond cranberries and strawberries one this is really really nice i like this because i really enjoy um cranberries and strawberries not too much of a fan of almonds i don't know i feel some type of way about almonds but i i really enjoy this snack bar this particular one and a nectarine i put this in the bag yesterday and never got around to eating it so i really like to have snacks when i'm on the road or i feel like i'm you know i need to nibble on something i would opt for snacks over like a packet of chips or popcorn or whatever i'll rather opt for snacks that's it that's all i carry in my bag and the bag is officially empty see how light it is when it's empty my goodness um i hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope to be back in a more energetic oh whatever but for now i am I'm, I'm sick guys i hope you guys are good i hope you guys are keeping well please subscribe to the channel please join the jk family like we are growing and i am living for it um uh, other than that i will see you guys in the next video sayonara